Hello everybody, this is Mr Chinksy, and this is the Mumbo Tokens and MT Honeycombs video of Busty Bucket Bay. Now, I have not been looking forward to this level, as a lot of people don't. Now, for the first one, you will need four eggs, two will bring it out so far, and yes, you can jump to it, but then if you... I know you need six. If you um, blow in two more eggs, and wow, camera, you can get these two gold feathers and one bow token. So it's extremely useful, and wow, I meant to get the moment token just then. There we go. <laughs> okay, and now the next one I can have a fair memory of. I I don't think there's one in there. I'm hoping there wasn't, isn't one in there, because um, I don't actually like that room very much whatsoever. Mind you, I don't like this whole level that much. Anyway, um, oh wow, whoa, I hold off in the jump thinking, um, whoa, that's not only water, that's acid. Well, it looks like acid anyway. So, um, next ones, well, uh, I'm assuming it's over here. I can't quite remember, to be honest. Um, a lot of these I am going on hope. And I shall end up cutting probably quite a lot, just to save people for them to watch it all. Okay, so there... I'm pretty sure there's one in here. Yes, there is. Okay. So, um, in this crate... Oh! I, I had a feeling I was going to get hurt there. If you just peck all the way along to destroy these enemies, and there's the Mumbo token. Now, I'm... Is that number three that I've collected? Yes, number three. So I started with 15, and there are 15 in this level. So I shall end up with 30, as there is no Mumbo's Hut in the level. This one you cannot get in just yet, so let's try this one. And no, there isn't. <laughs> um, let's see if there's one in here yeah, then, maybe? Okay, I'm pretty certain there's one in here. I'm almost definite. Um, so, let's jump up here. Yes, I knew there was one in here. So, um, in the left and middle crate, there are mumbo tokens. In the right-hand one, there is not. There's also the blue ginger in this one. So, yeah, just for reference for the gingos. Now, you cannot continue here. That is... Actually, no, I have seen it done. I'm going to see if I can... No! Ah, oh, I have seen it done. Is it by... Ah, oh, I'm sure I've seen it done. Oh. Okay, I'm going to... I'm just going to try this one more. No, one more. Ah, oh, no. Okay. <laughs> I'm sure I've seen that done by somebody. Can't remember who. I'm sure I've seen somebody do that. So, um, I am going to go onto the ship now itself. I'm pretty sure I've missed one or two, maybe, on the outside. But I'm just going to go onto the actual ship itself, purely because they're the ones I remember. So, um, the easiest way to get out, other than ladders, is this crate over here. I always find myself going to this crate for some reason. Just easy reference point, I suppose. So, um, just climb across here, over this, um roof thing, and onto the main ship. So, I know for definite there is one behind the, where the witch switch is, so I'm just going to go there first, and I know there's also one at the very front of the ship, this is the back by the way, back of the ship, so I know there's one at the very front, and, wait, why, why did I, oh yes I remember, uh, there's one on that lifeboat there, that's number five, I'm pretty sure there's not one in here, but it is going to be necessary for in there. You do need to press that switch to slow them fans down. Fortunately, this you for this part of the guide, I do not have to do the annoying time challenge. Um, all I have to do is survive that room, to be honest, which is probably the hardest part of the challenge. But still, still. Um, okay, I did not mean to miss that. This ladder here climb it, and 
on top of this platform here is the Witch Switch, but if you go behind it is the Mumbo Token number 6, and oh yeah, it's 50 feathers, 100 eggs. I was looking at that token and wondering why it wasn't going up, then I realised. Okay, so now to the very head of, head of the ship, just just to get more Mumbo Tokens, I suppose. Um, this isn't very organised guy, to be fair, but still, still, I'm just showing all 100, I mean, all 15 of the world. It's a very complex world. So, there's number 12, is it? No, 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 sorry, number 7, our 15. Okay, I just had to check notes really fast as to where they are, and I'm pretty sure there's one in here in one of the ovens. Yes, there is. So, uh, just collect that, and wow, I didn't actually mean to kill him. Never mind. But, uh, still, there's the Mumbo token in that oven. You do need golden feathers if you don't want to get hurt. So, now to continue. Uh, is there a breakable window on this side? It, yes, there is this one. So, um, into this one, and I do believe... Is there... No, there's a Jiggy, but that's the most in here, I believe. Uh, whoa, didn't mean... Oh, why not? I'll just get the Jiggy for the... Uh, just so I've got it. First Jiggy. Probably the easiest Jiggy, to be honest. But as I say, I'm going to be doing a Let's Play later on in this year for um, that. But, for now, on with the Mumbo Tokens. So, it's this opposite side then, where the uh, right window is. And it is this one. Is um No, go on further. Okay. So, if you... Come on! This is the navigation room, and there is a Mumbo token right here. Yep. Okay, so that is number 9 out of 15. And, oh, come on! Three of these enemies in here, and they're so annoying. Okay, so, um, now the next one is going to be in a centre periscope. One of the centre periscopes, this one. You can tell which one's real and which one's fake. There's always two by the side of each other. You can tell which one's real and which one's fake by the... whether it's red inside. So, there's the Mumbo token. There's also some notes in here. Wow, a boombox just exploded. Uh, come on. Oh, there's two boomboxes in there. <laughs> okay, so, just get out as fast as you can so you don't get exploded. And now, the next one I remember... And, come on, I can get up there. Oh. Okay, so I have collected 10 out of 15. I know where four more are. Ah. I think I'm missing one. I'll, I'll look it up in a second. But, uh, for now, the, um, the, I just jumped up here to get out of the way of that. But the Mumbo Token is right at the top of here. Uh, just climb all the way up, and it should be at the top. I don't know why I try and avoid notes. Whenever I'm doing this video, uh, Mumbo Token and Tunkham Piece video, I always just seem to want to avoid the notes. And if you jump up here, there is a Mumbo's Token. In the other one is a Jiggy, and I'm just going to get that very fast. Okay, I'm now, well, just here. Same, really. Same place. But, I have found where the other one is, and it is in one of the windows again. And this one, I believe, be careful of that enemy. I don't know why, but I always seem to forget that window even exists, purely because of how out of the way it is. And of course, I have to put an enemy right where the Mumbo token is. Oh! Right there! So, there are only three more Mumbo tokens left. But, purely for ease, I'm going to get one of the empty honeycomb pieces first. And it is right down here in the... Uh, I didn't mean to go in the water this early, but still, it is in the water, so it's a good start, I suppose. Um, if you come all the way over here, you will... Oh, yeah, the dolphin in the water. That's, that's for a jiggy. Uh, if you just looked in the bottom corner there, it, there was a dolphin trapped under the anang an anchor. That's for Jiggy. But, Snacker is in here. Oh, and it takes... I forgot to mention. Eh... Uh, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, how did... Why did Snacker disappear just then? Air uh, is took from you, even if you're above the water in here. Um, well, anywhere in Rusty Bucket Bay. And 
if you're underwater, it takes air double the speed. So, oh, I've got to press the button. <laughs> so, can't forget to press the button, and can I... Yes! <laughs> so, press the button, and then use the flying pad to collect the empty honeycomb piece. So, yeah, just quite simple. Oh, whoa, I honestly thought I was going to get hurt then. So, the only flying pad in this level, actually, is in a building where you can't really fly anywhere. So... There we go. This empty honeycomb piece for so long confused me. I had managed 100% the entire game, but except that single empty honeycomb piece, and up to 2010. In 2010, I finally decided to look it up and find where that empty honeycomb piece is to um, finish 100% the game. That is the last object I ever collected in the game. 100% it. Even the uh, secret items, like the mystery eggs and the I ice kit, I even collected them before the uh, that MC Honeycomb piece. So, I just... It, it's understandable, though, with how well hidden that is. So, I, I, I don't hate myself for uh, searching it up, because I honestly don't think I'd have any chance of finding it um, if I did try and look. Well, I did try and look, and I tried a lot, but... You know what I mean. I hope. And wow, I saved damage. Okay, but for the second empty honeycomb piece, just come in here. And the three mumbo tokens which are left are in here. And there's one of them there. there. For the other two, though, you do need to stop the... Um, well, slow down the fans, um, which I showed earlier in the video. And also, you will need to go right to the back of the room and... Um, Press the two individual. Oh! I just died. This is why I hate that room. I shall now meet you back in there. Oh yeah, and every time you die, you have to go press that button again in the periscope. I'll meet you back in that room. Oh come on! Oh, that. Oh. Okay, I'm now back up here, and I'm just killing that enemy so it doesn't kill me. That'd probably be the stupidest death. But, now, to carry on, you have to carefully jump through them. Oh, I'm just going to collect the Jiggy, purely because this room is just hell. Uh, I want to at least see some progress on the game stats screen. So, there's two buttons, one either side. You have to pass through fans to reach them. So, extremely annoying. Come on. Oh, yes. You have to press both of them to start the timer. It also slows them down. The second one stops them completely so you can get the jiggy. But, once you press the second one, a timer of, I believe, 56 seconds uh, comes on the screen. So it's extremely annoying and... Oh, yes! Yes, 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 yes. I'm just going to get this extra life. <laughs> I'm, I'm not running out of lives. I really do not want to run out of lives. Now, for this, I never cross the fans. I always... What is it? I always wait for this. Even though it's probably slightly more dangerous, I prefer it to the fans. And it's not 56 seconds, it's... Is it... Was, did that say 66? I don't know. But there's the first of the... Three, well, second of the three in here. Oh yeah, and by pressing both switches, these stop completely. Which is very useful, because you cannot get the mumbo tokens otherwise. So, they, there is all um, 15 mumbo tokens and two empty income pieces. So, I bid you all farewell. Bye.